Hello everyone and welcome to my reaction to Tenkaichi Chapter 15. Uh, hopefully, this will be a bit of a palate cleanser after the uh, recent record of Ragnarok chapters, since Tenkaichi has not disappointed me yet. Uh, I do know that this chapter at least delves into a bit of a William backstory, so that'll be pretty interesting to see what the fuck is going on with him. Uh, so, you know, like, subscribe, uh, and without any further ado, let's get right into today's chapter. In the year 1564, in Kent County, England, William Adams was born. While he made a living as a seaman, like his father, his mother trained him in a certain martial art. Chapter 15, Sea Monster. William's mother was a woman, though she was... Wait, hold on. William's mother, a woman though she was, became a seasoned warrior fighting as a proxy combatant in the trial-by-combat system that was prevalent in Europe at the time. And thus, blessed with a superb talent for the martial arts, she passed on the art of the Dirk Dance, which she herself refined to her son, who had inherited her own talent. I see, so his mom is also a crazy bitch. This is very nice. I find that very attractive. Uh, and, you know, William's a psycho. <laughs> so you're looking forward to my Dirk dance. Can a samurai like you even dance to begin with? Naturally, even I have the skill for dancing. <laughs> That's hot. God, I'll never get over that. <laughs> uh, that will... Uh, I'll never get used to that. Then let's put on a little show. For the audience we've got here. But... Think you can keep up with me? And he's looking like a demon right here once again. Ooh, I think he backed off. You're dragging behind. Ooh, wait, no. He kind of like did almost like a late, like a sword lock basically. What? What is this? Oh, I see. So he put his blade up against the um, flat end of the katana, like the back of it, and is now pushing it. Now let's get get it started. All right, we're going into it. Through the crossing of our blades, he's controlling my motions. Oh, did he land a slash on Yagyu? Well, how's it feel dancing with me? Oh, there we go. He went for a slash. What? Yagyu Dono's finally got cut. There he is. Yeah. Well, he already got kicked in the face, but it seems like actual first blood goes to William. Now, knowing what an insane person Yagyu is, is he going to literally cum his pants in the next few pages? Let's find out. My word. <laughs> Once anyone gets caught up in Adam's dancing, they can't fight of their own free will. But his true specialty is still yet to come. I remember it well. The shock I received the day I first saw him. That is the most... I have never... S oh, fuck's sake. I have never seen a dragon like that before. That's really cool. That's the first time in a while I've seen a really unique dragon design. I like that a lot. That's really cool. But what is his true specialty? Right? I don't know. <laughs> we're gonna find out. Oh, we're about to find out right now, I think. Three months prior. Suo Chosu Domain. Sire, I bring urgent news. I'm currently busy with selecting the Mori clan's representative for the Tenkaichi. We spotted a wrecked foreign ship along the shore, sir. We, but just as we went to search for any crew, a beast came out of the ship. A beast. I thought my retainer was exaggerating when he called it a beast. This way, sire. But what in the... Once I laid eyes on it, I thought otherwise. I thought that thing was a creature none should dare challenge, a sea monster. So, all of these dudes got their asses beat naked. Don't we have various pictures that correlate to this? You know the naked guy walking around in the street having a confrontation with the police? I recall, actually, that doesn't really narrow it down a lot. That's happened a few times, but it's like that. The naked crackheads who can beat up cops. That's what William reminds me of right now. Impossible. 
killed dozens of my men completely alone, and I became convinced. Took you long enough to get here. You're the boss around these parts, aren't you? That language you're speaking is ing. Bring me girls and liquor right this instant. <laughs> Otherwise, I'll kill you and take all your territory. <laughs> so my man was lost. Probably lost at sea for months, if I'm remembering how things worked. It, it took William a while to get to Japan, if I remember correctly. So he's a bit starved at the moment. That I, a we clear boss, had met the most fearsome monster in the entire world. So everyone, everyone's got a hype demon now. Toda had Zen, which was actually part of like his ability. Um, Fuma had the weird, fucked up, demonic human centipede. Uh, Yagyu has the Grim Reaper, and... Well, I guess this isn't a dragon, actually. Uh, William has a sea serpent. Quite fitting for him, you know, the whole, uh, yeah. Um, but cool visuals. I like it. Alright, so they're going at it. What's wrong, Master Yagyu? Your footwork's gotten slower. Oh, well, he got cut again on the arm. Oh, going in for a blade lock. Getting that gorgeous body of yours covered in bloods just made you more appealing. Christ, I really do need to leave you. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. Oh my god. This guy's... This guy's too much. He's too much. I can't... He's hilarious. But I... I listen, I can't endorse this, this kind of behavior. I can't endorse it. So I, I have to root for Yagyu. I understand Neve ignores it because Scotland forever. I get it. My word, Yagyu Dono hasn't been able to keep his own distance at all. It's like William's making him dance around. Is this all part of William's plan? Titties, yes, the titties. <laughs> Not surprised there. There's a technique in Western sword fighting rarely seen in Japan in which fighters lock blades to overpower their opponent, known as a bind, of course. The dirk dance, martial art with an unusual sense of time and distance, and the bind to control his opponent. Anyone who fights against William Adams, who utilizes the two as one, will struggle and drown as if sucked within a vortex, and we see him being surrounded by the sea monster. Hmm... Feeling worried, Nobu, Nobutada-sama? <laughs> but it is not... But is it not you who is worried? Just where have you been off to? Who is this? Takuanbo. I don't recognize this person. I'm not a Japanese history nerd. So I'm gonna assume one of you guys knows who this is. This seems like an important reveal. I don't want to see Munanori in the act of killing, that's all. <laughs> Then you ought to have stayed asleep inside. Munanori will not change his ways to suit your demands. The reason being that Yagyu Munanori is a natural-born killing machine. What's wrong? Your whole body's starting to get sluggish. About ready to give in? <laughs> no, he's not. You're, you're about to see something a little crazy. <laughs> I see now. So this is the dirt dance. To control one's opponent and make them move against their own will, a very dreadful and very enjoyable game to play. So I like that y Yagyu earlier, when he was getting all excited about stuff, he, he looked like a literal demon, he looked like an ogre. Now he's just doing like a normal sort of uh, evil smile you see with psychotic anime characters. When he goes over the brink, does he just become normal crazy? I wonder. <sighs> what? Very well then. You dance to my lead. Yeah, there you go. He just he's become normal evil. Normal kind of sinister. <laughs> it's like um Um It's like when someone usually when they're angry they get like really over the top and shit. But then, when they go, like, absolutely livid, just completely blank-faced. It's just like a quiet fury. But in this case, it's just being a, a fucking maniac. 
And William is shocked. And now he's been caught up in Yagyu's use of the Dirk Dance. This can't be. Is this a bind? There you go. He's l Yagyu's already learned how to use William's fighting style. <laughs> but I don't believe... Unless... Being able to use Dirk Dance and Bind is William's true power. I don't think this is his... The, the true um, frightening power of William Adams. I don't think we've seen it quite yet. How the hell can he use... <laughs> That move of yours is incredibly useful, but still so feeble, and a long way from perfection. I, however, shall not allow you to lift a single finger. Oh, um, and we see, it looks like William is underground, he's getting like sucked around in a vortex or something, like his body's getting all stretched out, it's pretty cool. What is this? This sensation, yeah, it looks like he's melting. He's ensnared my limbs so quickly. I can't do a thing to resist. Will William get turned on by getting dominated? <laughs> this feels just like a great wave in human form. So we've got a, a, a tsunami versus a sea monster. It, amazing. Outstanding. Incredible. What the hell's going on now? Ooh. Is this? Ooh! Moon Aaron's using William's own moves to drive him back. Huh? Sky's getting... Oh, and now it's raining. Oh, Jesus. Hmm. The time is nigh, it seems. Takuanbo, if you do not wish to watch, then leave while the leaving is good. And out storming, storm is brewing. Have you awakened, Sensei? Ah, so now, um... Kamizumi has woken up. Oh, shit. Wait, so he's just dreaming about titties. Oh, that's, yeah, that's even better. This bloodlust must be Munanori, yes. He is fighting most resolutely, sir. Ho, ho. Very nice. Oh, he's like a, wow, what a cheery old man. He looks, he looks serene. His eyes have such a shine to them. That's neat. I like that. The Yagi Munanori of history was a samurai highly esteemed in many fields. Swordsmanship, philosophy, politics. However, William Dona, these rehearsals of yours are now over. He had a hidden side to him, of which was never written in the records of history, of course. Uh, we got a big wave crashing against the ship. Everyone's getting tipped over. The waves have gotten more intense. And now, allow me. It's true nature, the nature of the Reaper was revealed to lead you into hell. The bloodlust of an Asura, far too cruel to be passed on for posterity. All right, now he's gone back to the ogre. Oh my God. And the visuals, like the Grim Reaper's face, this is the first time we've seen it and it's like a skeleton Oni. That's so fucking cool. Oh, problematic scans. I love you and your joke pages. Ah, well, that was a pretty good chapter. That was pretty good. That was really solid. Uh, I really like the way this fight's turning out this far. I really like the visuals. The, um, the visual metaphor, the, uh, Toriko hype demons and such. I'm a really big fan of it. Um, I know the, um, the raws for the next chapter should be coming out in the next few days, but... It's been like almost a month since the last, like the rods for this chapter came out. So I'm not expecting to get another chapter for a while, which is fine because I know that's how it generally works with Tenkaichi. Um, so yeah, with that, that's going to be all for today's reaction. If you enjoyed, please be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and click that notification bell so you don't miss any of my uploads. I do Tenkaichi chapter reactions whenever a new chapter gets translated. If you enjoy discussing Tenkaichi with other people or... If you just enjoy the content I produce on this channel, I highly suggest you check out my Discord server. I have a link to that down in the description. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys around. Take care.